Hello everyone. Welcome to Stack Admin Template Build Process video. So now the main question is, what is Stack Admin Template Builder? It is offline admin template builder tool for Windows, Mac, and Linux system to easily create responsive Bootstrap admin template. So is it complicated? No, not at all. You just need to follow the steps shown in this video or refer the documentation to run the template builder task and your responsive admin template will be ready. Why we have created this builder? To generate all the pages with desired customization options like navbar, navigation types, page headers, footers, and LTR or RTL version in just a few minutes. You can refer stack admin templates build process diagram in documentation. Let's talk about template build process now. To be able to generate a template, you must download and install Node.js. NPM stands for Node Package Modules and it is a way to manage development dependencies through Node.js and you can download it from Node.js.org. Once you install Node, you can check it in your terminal window by using these commands node hyphen hyphen version and npm hyphen hyphen version. Grunt and Gulp are JavaScript task runners. In one word, automation. The less work you have to do when performing repetitive tasks like minification, compilation, unit testing, linting, etc. Stack build system use the grunt and gulp task to generate the different templates. You have the options to build a template using either grunt or gulp according to your preference. If you are interested in grunt, then go ahead and install grunt globally using npm install hyphen g grunt hyphen cli command. As we have already installed grunt, we are going to test the installation using grunt hyphen hyphen version command. If it doesn't work, then you must install grunt locally using npm install grunt hyphen cli command. If you are interested in gulp, then go ahead and install gulp using npm install hyphen g gulp hyphen cli command and test the installation using gulp hyphen hyphen version command. If it doesn't work, then install gulp locally use by removing dash g from the installation command. Once you have installed grunt or gulp, navigate to the root stack admin folder and run npm install command which will automatically install all the required local dependencies using package.json file. If you are using curl, make sure to rename default package.json file to package.grunt.json file as package.json file is already used for grunt. Rename package.gulp.json file to package.json file. Then run npm install which will automatically install the required local dependencies .json file for gulp. npm install command is going to take some time to install all the node dependencies. We will skip this installation process and will resume once installed.
you may face few warning during the installation process but you can just ignore those warnings grunt file.js file contain all the predefined grunt tasks let's go through them the first command is grunt dist hyphen clean this command will clean the js as and css folder from app assets folder Here you can see the CSS and JS folder will going to be clean from app assets folder. Now the second command is grunt dist hyphen JS. This grunt task will clean the JS folder from the app assets and copy JS file from src folder minify them the third command is grunt sas compile this command will compile core main app pages and plugin as css files to css file and the next command is grunt dist css this command will clean the css folder compile all the as css files auto prefix them organize them and finally minify them in app assets css folder if you are using the rtl you can run this grunt dist css rtl command and the next command is grunt dist html we will look this into this command in later this command will compile all the page files and create the relative html pages into the html folder in this command you need to pass the layout layout name and text direction and the next command is grunt dist this command is the combination of grunt dist css and js it will generate the both folder into app assets folder and the next command is grunt monitor this command will watch all the as css and j file changes and compile it accordingly in this command you need to pass the layout layout name and text directions and the next command is grunt server this command will start browser sync to check the any changes into the browser without refreshing the window we are using the all same command with the gulp prefixing this all command are same as we have used in grunt stack admin comes with seven predefined templates where five are vertical and two are horizontal we will explain the build process for vertical menu template with ltr text direction before you run the template build task make sure you include exactly the same template that you want to generate in the template.jd file this file can be found under src template builder page folder as you can see we have uncommented vertical menu template to build it you have to uncomment only the template of your preference and comment all the other templates 
you cannot uncomment more than one template at the same time else it will generate the last uncommented template from this file. Let's look into how the build command is formed. This is the generic command structure where you can replace the parameters according to the below table. As we are generating the template, our task parameter will be dist HTML, layout parameter will be vertical menu template as we are generating a vertical menu template. Layout name parameter will, will be the any custom name you would like to give for the folder to be generated and last one is the text direction parameter which can be LTR or RTL according to your preference. Let's have a look at sample, monitor, build and starter kit commands for vertical menu template. In this table, we have also listed the same commands for the all other templates. Let's generate vertical menu template using build command which we have just formed. Let's run this command into the terminal. Once you run the grunt build command for vertical menu template, it will start building process and it will create a layout folder inside the HTML LTR folder and start generating the HTML files. It will take some time to generate all the HTML files from Jade. This build system will help you to generate any layout with the desired customize, customization option to save your time. Thanks for watching video.